According to thedailynation.com, many adults have started bringing chaperones with huh. them to go on dates. One woman said she was open to having another pair of eyes on her after getting feedback from her date that she came off as too strong-willed and not affectionate enough. And after her chaperone observed her next date, she was told that the guys were actually right and she'd have to work harder on letting them in. So, Jeannie, yeah. you're now, you know, on the dating scene. I got my toe in there, girl. <laughs> got it, got it. Yeah. A pinky toe, a pinky toe. I got a couple swipes and then I put the phone away because I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> Would you be down to have an adult chaperone accompany, accompany on your date? Okay, we've talked about getting rated on dates a while ago. Yes. Yeah. And remember, you guys looked at me crazy when I actually said I wouldn't mind it. Here's why. I think a lot of people, I, I really love, if I was in school, I'd probably study psychology or some type of, um, understand more about paraverbal skills because paraverbal skills speak higher, speak louder than your, what you say or um, what you actually mean. Your body language says a whole different thing. I have friends who have not gotten dates. I actually have one friend who hasn't, she's been on Tinder for, th for three years, hasn't had many success on dates at all, hasn't had a boyfriend ever and I just thought what how is that work now she's really attractive she's so sweet she's so smart she's independent I'm like what is what's going on let me see your text messages and when I read her text message exchanges with other men everything she said she thought she was being cool and cooperative but she really was kind of slamming him down and shutting it down and also not making his jokes funny he you know some guys would say funny jokes some wouldn't mm -hmm. but you gotta encourage them throw them a bone to make it feel like okay we're, yeah. we're going somewhere you know so for me, I think I'm a good dater, but then I'd really actually want somebody to sit there to be like, you came off too easy, girl, you look like a hoe. Like somebody's gotta tell me that, you know? Yeah. Or you, you're clammed up, you seem like you're still bitter about your past or something. I don't, th good friends are there to tell us, yeah. but right. are they really there to tell you on your dates? That's when you really know, well, because mean, your guard I is off. I can just imagine me on a date with an adult chaperone, say somebody like Tamara, oh, right? Geez. Oh, jeez, oh jeez. Oh, Tamara be saying, what? you know, Lonnie, no more brown liquor, you know. you cut her off. I would. I would yeah. cut her off. She would cut me off. Stop touching his penis. Yeah. You know, it's just, and, it's, and it just would and not. stop doing that thing with your tongue. You always do the thing with your tongue. What is that? that? I don't know if she you can do like it on this. TV. I don't, yeah. No, it's a little bit worse than that. It, 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 the point is, <laughs> you know, it depends on who the person would be. But, I don't think I need a, a, to me, if you grown, you should be able to handle yourself. That's to me. Yeah, yes, you can yeah. handle yourself, but do you come off the way you want to so that you can hopefully move so on you to the next I would ask the person you would that obviously, I'm dating. Wait, you would obviously have someone that you know and that you trust. Yes. And that they can actually read body yes. language and signs. I okay. actually think that I'd you be great. Would be, I think be you'd great. be a good person I really to come would. with me on a date. I really I would. would. You would. Because, would. But my issue is, why would we call you <laughs> a chaperone? Why don't y'all just go on group dates, which I think are so healthy in the beginning. You get to know each other, you get to know each other's because friends. It's one because person. you got one job. No, I'm, I, I love group dating. When I but first I think started I would dating. Be incognito, I, though. I would yes, be incognito, like, though. Yes. I would be like on the side. So yes. she would be at the bar. She'd have on a hat that and I'm a having trench dinner coat. And that's yes. weird. <laughs> I'd rather you just be in the mix <laughs> as a friend. <laughs> yes. The only difference is if I had you as a group sh or as a chaperone date, then I, I would just kind of, you know, I'd. I'd Censor yourself. Yeah, I keep myself a little bit more well behaved. You know, like if I knew I wanted to get a little sucky sucky now, uh -huh, then I'd bring uh -huh. my girl Adrian. Okay. Because then Adrian be like, yes, girl, go home, do that thing. <laughs> I am not promoting for the <laughs> cheese. <Jeannie. Jeannie>. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. I... It would be a good time to say the least. Okay.